Hey there, it's Mark from Men Who Bullet. Thanks for checking out today's video. I'm so excited to bring this to you today because I am just as excited as you might be about this video because we are going to be taking a look at Plotter. Now, if you're not familiar with Plotter, they are a Japanese brand that's focused on analog tools for creators and for creatives to both express themselves and organize their projects. And when I started to learn a little bit more about this brand as I was talking with them, I got really excited about it because if you don't know me already, I'm always looking for a better way to organize my information and kind of keep it all together. And while I love the bullet journal method for work and also for planning as well, don't get me wrong, there's just some things that I miss out on a little bit and I think this might be the thing for me. This is their five year anniversary and they just announced that there is now a branch in the United States. So they will be bringing all of the amazing products from Plotter that have been exclusive to Japan over here to the United States to be offered for anybody who's looking to get into them. So they sent me over some of their products to take a look at and that's what we're going to be unboxing today. I know for sure that inside of here there's going to be a binder which has clips so it's a ring type binder that clips as well as some notepads of different types and some other inserts that they were telling me about and accessories and some other cool things so they were like we're going to surprise you a little bit but we're after talking with them they were like we think we know what might work best for you and so they sent them over so let's go ahead and check that out i do want to let you know i'll be doing more videos as i get into this system more i'm just really hyped up on it but today we'll just be unboxing and taking a look at what's in here me getting to learn a little bit more about them and who they are and their products and hopefully sharing more of that with you as well. So let's go ahead and get into it. It's going to be the unboxing today of Plotter. Okay, I'm really excited as I'm pulling everything out of this box. Right off the bat, we have a Plotter sticker, which is going to go right onto my sticker wall. You know, I love my sticker wall back there. We also have the tissue paper, which is branded both with that logo and Plotter as well. Let's open this up. Oh my goodness. I didn't know what to expect. I still don't know what to expect, <laughs> honestly, but I've just heard such wonderful things about this, this planner. Oh my goodness. So here we go. Let's open it up. Okay. This is a certification here. I'm not sure what this says on here, but we'll just put that over to the side. All right, so for plotter, here we go. I can read this one before using your binder. Our leather binders are subject to rigorous quality control and crafting standards, but make sure to read these instructions. Okay, I will definitely do that. This is my first official like leather notebook for real. Subjecting the binder to impact, dropping it, or applying inappropriate amounts of pressure may cause the rings to break off or otherwise damage the binder. I do not want that. Attempting to close the binder when overfilled applies extra pressure that damages the rings. Uh, bending the binder 180 degrees or more applies pressure that may damage. Using the bandwidth lifter, which is sold separately, reduces the load pages apply on the binder rings. Okay. Our leather binder is made from a single piece of leather bracketed by a ringed spine and a back plate. This simple design features an exposed back plate, so the construction is delicate. All right. Our logo is silk screened on the back of the leather. Individual appearances may vary. The logo may distress over time due to the characteristics of the leather. Color may transfer to parts that overlap the logo. The logo may fade or come off as a result of use or storage. All right. Plotter, here we go. All right, like this is a commitment and this isn't just your run of the mill product. All right, we got another one in here. It has the Plotter logo on it. Plotter, it's a noun. Planner, organizer, strategist. Tools to make drawing and designs. Methodology for thinking. Those who change the context. Tools for change makers. I'm ready to make some change. <laughs> Let's check this out. So it comes in like a protective little bag here. Oh. All right, look at that. Look at that color. Oh my goodness. 
I don't feel fancy enough to own something like this right now. <laughs> Look at that. So we've got the plotter logo here, a nice solid band. We've got the binders inside of here and that leather cover. All right, so our first thing here is the plotter. So this is the same thing that we're on the other little piece that we just got over here. Another and color. It goes a little bit deeper into what each one of those stands for. We've taken the word plotter and redefined it to mean a person who shapes the future or gives birth to change. There's nothing more important than building tomorrow, so we have created tools to help you do it. How amazing is that? Proudly handmade in Japan, we are thoughtfully committed to preserving Japanese techniques. Tools made with the unique craftsmanship of Japanese artisans, refusing modern designs with master crafting techniques. And these are some usage precautions here. Binder bracket warranty. That previous one had me a little scared here. <laughs> Make sure I take care of these brackets. Thank you very much for purchasing a plotter product. We will repair any damages that occur during normal use within a year of purchase. Be aware that additional charges may be required in the following circumstances. If you do not present your warranty, if the date, location, or purchase are not indicated on the warranty, if damage are the result of natural abrasions or dropping during use, if damage is the result of impact or malfunction due to misuse, if damage or malfunction are the result of natural disasters. The warranty is valid for use only within Japan and shall not be reissued. So I'm going to assume that there might not be a warranty for it here in the US, but we'll have to confirm that. Okay, and some other pieces here, very nice. All right. Oh, look at that. The same thing that's been throughout is actually put on the inside of this here. Plotter organizer, drawing tools, all of that. All right, so that's this. Um, let me go ahead and just press those little things down. I'm just gonna pop these out for right now and put these to the side because um, I wanna go ahead and check out the extra accessories that came and then we'll go ahead and, and fill this out. So let's sit those over there. We'll move our bag over. So let's go ahead and grab the first thing here. So the first thing here is plotter. This is plain refill memo pads. So from what I've understood about this system so far and what I've learned is that you have these memo pads that you can keep at your desk, but they are designed to work with this. So if I'm writing down ideas, I'll be able to tear one of these off and put them right into the binder here. This looks like just one of the extra example sheets um, that they have on here. So if you're sketching out ideas or something like that, that's what you could use this plain paper for. And then just put, just put it right into here. All right, so let's set that over to the side. So that's plain paper here. This next one says two millimeter grid refill memo pad. Okay, so this is going to have two millimeter grid. That is very little grid, but I like that. Oh, look at that. So it has space up here for dates. So you could do like five one and put in any extra details that you need to put on your pages there. It's super nice. And this works just like those memo pads. So they're adhered over on this side so you can easily tear them out and then add them to your notebook. Okay, put that over to the sides. This is so exciting. Plotter to-do list. This is the refill memo pad. This looks like something that I would definitely be using inside of here if I wasn't sketching like other ideas with the other paper. So this is the to do. So we'll open this up. So we have mission, we have the space over here for the date, and then percentage to complete. Ooh, I like this. So this is like a little project planner here. Here's weekly task. It looked like you would draw in how far you are into your percentage and then checking that off when that's done. That's pretty neat definitely would be using this. Okay, project manager, six assorted colors. Okay, so I did hear about these little project managers 
And aside from obviously this entire beautiful planner and everything else, this is what really got me excited. So because this is one of the smaller ones and the rings are kind of small, the idea is that you wouldn't use this f like for an entire year, but you could use this for like individual notes or projects. And so these project planners, if I'm remembering correctly, it's been a minute. The way that they work is that they, they can go inside of your binder here. Let's pop this in here. Oh, it has a thing inside of it. Here we go. And so the way it works is that you can put the project name and any notes that you have here, the team members, right? And then on the inside, you have your, your chart essentially, which could be similar, I'm guessing, to like some of your to-do list perhaps, but you can put whatever details you need inside of here with specific dates. And so as you are working on different ideas, let's say that this was like a whole idea that I had for a project, you would open it up and you would put all of your pages in here. And these are like your little project manager books. So you can go through your ideas and any notes that you might have about a specific project and keep it all organized right here. Oh my gosh, that's so exciting. <laughs> oh, this is so cool. All right, and so there's more of those. So this comes with six of them. So it's the same exact thing in six colors. I'm loving these subtle colors. They're not like screaming in your face. Very high end, very beautiful. The paper quality is really nice as well. I'd almost be scared to write on these, but I know that you're supposed to. Okay, let's set that to the side. So this is the ring support. Oh, so this is, so when we were reading about making sure that your rings are supported so that you don't break them, this is what that was for. So it's uh, a piece of leather, reducing pressure marks of leather by rings. Okay, so. Let's see how this would work here. My guess is that you would actually put this in first. I'm not sure how this works. I've never used one of these before, so I'm not totally sure. Let's look at the directions a little bit closer. So I'm not gonna mess anything up. I'm going to ask more questions. Sorry that I can't show you how to do that just yet, but believe me, there will be future videos. Okay, so here's another one. This is the pen holder with lift. Oh, it also comes with a nice little cursive sample. Okay, so let's pop this open again. It's so petite. So this can go right inside of here, just like that. That way it has the extra space so it sits outside of your journal here. Let's get a really fancy pen for this. We're gonna take out the Avenger, one of the fountain pens that I have. Look at that. I can fit right inside of here. I don't wanna force it too much because it's brand new. So maybe I wouldn't pick that one. It fits almost all the way, but right into the cap. So we'll take out Old Faithful here, <laughs> my Uniball DX. So it fits right inside of there. So you can carry this around with you. You have your pen holder right here with you all the way along. It does hold on there very nice and tight. So I just tried to take it out and the cap came with it. Oh my gosh. Can I just tell you how terrified I am that I'm going to like mess this up and I just opened it for the first time. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I want like a nicer pen for this. I don't know that these will be able to, like I need something that just like clips or something, but we'll, we'll think more about that as we continue to work with this in the future. So that's the pen holder with lifter. Okay, next is band with lifter. 
Okay, let's take that out and let's try this. Okay. Oh, okay, look at this. So this goes right inside of here too. And then you would close your notebook here. And then you can use that to help keep it shut. Ooh, I like that. But I'm curious, does it start to add too many lifters? I don't know, maybe that's a part of like how this works, but. All right, so that actually works really nicely together. So we have our pen holder here, and then we have our band to help keep this shut. This is so nice. Like I've never owned anything this fancy before. All right. Let's take a look at the last thing that we have here. So this actually looks like a, an accessory for a different size. So yeah, this is for the A5 size where all of these have been for the narrow size so far. So it won't fit inside of here, but I still love this idea. This is a whiteboard pad. That's pretty neat. That's cool. All right, let's open it up. And let's check it out. So. There's a lot of different sizes of these, obviously, that you can pick from. So whiteboard, pad, portable, trifold whiteboard. This is neat. As a designer myself, if I was using this at work, um, I would totally <laughs> be taking this everywhere with me. Like you want to come up with like a quick idea or something. So this whole thing opens up. Let's move my little guy over. Okay, well, let's try it out. Let's see. That's neat. You can kind of draw whatever you whatever you want on here. Of course, I will doodle a little face. <laughs> oh, do we have another color over here? <gasps> we do. Okay, that's super cool. So you just have that. So it's just a whiteboard marker. So you can really use anything, but this is really neat. And then just a dry erase. So you can just erase it with a piece of paper or whatever. And then you can fold this up and then you can put this right inside. So I have the narrow size here for everything. So this obviously isn't going to fit exactly perfectly, but if you had the A5 size, this would fit right inside your notebook. And then you could take it out whenever you needed to, or I guess technically you could be able to flip over the page and like draw outside of your notebook if you needed to. I don't know, that's neat. Wow, so I'm really excited to start using this. I need to still get this ring support in here the right way. That's the only thing I can't figure out just yet how to do. But everything else I'm just so ready for. I've got the little project managers, which I'm thrilled about. I think this is going to be really cool. And then I have my to-do list refill, so I can take each one of these out or take out a few and fill them inside of my binder. We've got our two millimeter grid here. So same deal, we could take out a few of these and add them inside of there if I needed them. And then just the plane for ideas. So regardless of how I'm working, whether it's at my desk and adding slowly into here, or maybe just putting a few extra pieces, this is really awesome system. So you're gonna see me using this a lot more in the near future for projects, and I'll keep you updated on Plotter and the other cool things I'll be doing with this. I'm so excited to continue to play with and learn more about Plotter and how to use both the narrow size here with all of those inserts. And I cannot wait to play around more with those project planners. I have an idea in my mind on how I want to use them. And in a few weeks, I'll have a follow-up video that'll show you exactly how I've been using this for different content creation and things like that as well. If you haven't done so already, make sure you subscribe to this channel and tap that bell. And that way you'll get notified when I have brand new videos that are going to be coming out in the very near future. Also, if you're interested in getting more updates as well, I have a brand new email newsletter, which you can sign up for down below. And if you're interested, I'll also pop some of the freebies that I've been offering out over the past few months as well for you. We've got headers and we've got other type of bullet journal inserts and things like that for you, some different fonts. I've been having a lot of fun with the freebies and I love offering them to you. So all of those links will be in the descriptions for you below as well. Thanks again for checking out this video today and I cannot wait to learn more 
more and talk to you more about Plotter and uh, some other fun stuff in the very near future. I'll talk to you soon. Happy planning. Mm-hmm.